Lee, six years ago you decided to purchase the Joe Mars AWT3 machine from Eurospark. It's benefited you in more ways than one. So what was the main reason behind the purchase? Well, initially we bought it for, for test pieces, for uh, making test pieces to cut all the milling process out. Especially with your more exotic materials, your, your harder materials. Um, but since then we've discovered that we can cut keyways for rolling dies, which has saved us an absolute fortune. Um, cut down on costs and lead times as well. But you kind of been able to take control of that as well, haven't you? With that, yeah. In it, so rather than it go away to be subcon somewhere else, I mean you're relying on them to get it you back on time. We can decide when we can put it on the machine. Decide when we want to make it. Now, before we get all technical into the machine, what was the main reason behind the decision to purchase this particular machine? I think it was. The, foot, the, foot, the initial footprint, the size of the machine, the working envelope, um, that it was just the right size. I, I think, having spoken to, with Eurospark and, and with Ryan, um, he picked the machine for, for the, the, the job that we wanted to do. Um, Written the programs so everything was done for us, proved it all out, and that's why we, we brought this machine. So you've actually visited Eurospark themselves? Yeah, yeah, we visited Eurospark. Um, that took us down there to prove the program, show us the machine working. Uh, it was a really kind good of visit. Giving you that confidence, essentially. Yes, basically, yeah. So, what is it you're making here at Beck Prosper? Um, we make a wide range of petrochemical fasteners, um, standard fasteners, uh, specials, um, whatever the customer requires, really. Right, let's get a tech spec on the machine. Steve, I know you operate this machine, but you cover this area, so what is it you do here? We make dies and we do milling of test pieces, and that's what we've got on at the minute, uh, key ways for the dies that we're making. Brilliant, okay, do you like using the machine? Uh, yeah, it's pretty simple. When we get together, we get the programmes written, and it's easy to set up and get running. So Steve, what about the servicing on this? Once a month, we uh, stop it and do a filter change. Uh, nozzle change and the crystals in the back so it can keep it running. So overall, is it making your life better and why? It, it's a good machine, it's easy to set up and it can be left on its own once it's running so you can carry on doing other jobs.